Hey guys, uh, well, I just wanted to shoot a quick video. I got a new piece of uh, equipment to go with my CNC today. Um, a few months back, I added the power draw bar, and man, that thing's saving you. It saves me so much time. Uh, it is definitely one of the most time-saving. Uh, accessories that you can add to your meal um, especially if you do a lot of uh, tool changes like I do um, definitely the best thing you can do to the meal is the belt conversion uh, CNC conversion and then adding this power draw bar most definitely uh, got to go very high up on the list uh, the problem with the power draw bar is it needs air and uh, if you're like me, you've got a pretty good size air compressor. And when I started this off, I was using that air compressor, but it's just too big and it's too loud. And I, I just didn't want to, I just didn't need that big of an air compressor. So I thought, well, I'll just buy me a small little pancake compressor and use that. And so that's what I did. Uh, the problem with the little pancake is it works fine. But the problem with that is uh, it frequently comes on, and when it comes on, it is very, very loud. Very, very loud. So what I thought I'd do is just uh, show you what I've got now. I've been looking online, and I found a silent air compressor. Now this air compressor is a two and a half gallon tank versus my three gallon pancake. And but it puts out my little pancake only puts out 0.6 CFM and this one puts out uh 1.1 CFM at uh 90 psi. So should fill up quicker and that'll be great. But let me just show you how loud this is. This is supposed to be rated at 65 decimals. I'm not sure what this one is, but as you can see, it's pretty loud. I'm talking in my normal voice, and the camera is about 12 inches away from my mouth as I'm talking. So you can see that this is a pretty loud air compressor. And when you're in a shop trying to work, and this thing kicks on, So if you, in case you didn't hear anything I just said, when this thing kicks on and you're in the shop working, uh, it scares the heck out of you. And again, I'm, my voice is, uh, my mouth is about 12 inches away from the camera. And you can see how loud that was. So let's see if we can get this silent air compressor to kick on. And uh, we'll see how loud it is. Alright, so I'm about the same distance away from it. And my mouth is the same distance away from the camera. This is my normal voice. And as you can see, a lot quieter. Uh, it's still, it's, you know, it's 65 decimals, but you can still have a conversation with it running. So, uh, this is going to be a lot better. And for the money I paid for this, you guys aren't going to believe this, I paid $78 for this. $78 off eBay I found this compressor for. Now this, is, this compressor is identical to a California silent air compressor. Uh, I'm not exactly what sure what model the California air compressor model is, but I'll try to put that into the... Um, Try to put that into the links on the video uh, up in the description. But I got this off of eBay. Yeah, I got a supply off eBay. I'm not sure what the brand is. It's it's not really a brand. Um, but they have two models. This is the 2510 that I have, and this is the 2010. Uh, difference being. 
this there's a twin tank the twin tank is only a two gallon and then the single tank which what I have was a two and a half gallon and this one looked to be a little bit bigger so I went with the smaller one I think the compressor and everything else is just the same uh, and the whole thing probably weighs I don't know 40 pounds maybe a little more but the compressor is pretty big I mean these silent air compressors I'm not sure exactly how they work uh, but it's oil free maintenance free uh, and I think it's going to work really good out here in the shop for the uh, power draw bar so So I'm really, really, I'm really happy to get this thing and, and start using it. And like I said, yeah, $78 is what I paid for this compressor. And it cost me uh, $34 to ship it. Something like that. Yeah, $34 to ship it. So for $112, I got this compressor for. Now, just as a comparison, this cheap, I mean, this is really cheap pancake compressor I paid... I want to say $45 for her, and I'd much rather have this uh, as far as the noise. As far as the longevity, we'll see, but I will definitely be using it. So um, I'll keep you updated on that. So I appreciate you watching the videos, and if you have compressor issues and you need something a little bit quieter, check out these silent air compressors. Man, these things are great. Alright, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the videos and please subscribe.